Well, hello everyone once again. And in this video, I'm going to talk about what I call the pop-up that might also be called uh, a punch-out, although I would kind of think, uh, I, I sort of think punch-out is more of a static thing, where a pop-up is the most of, it's basically getting up over an obstacle, and it's basically trying to correct a mistake that I see some people do. Because um, what I see people do is they, they sort of get the hang of flying fast, sort of going along like this, and uh, they think, I know, I'm going to go over that tree there, and so they, they're like, I'll hit the throttle, and it's like, whoa, Occasionally, they hold a tree because they think they're going to go up instantly, but because they... Oh, hang on, the wind just coming over. <laughs> Change position to try and hide my microphone. So it's, it's all about angle of attack, really. If your attitude is here, going really quick, and you pump the throttle, it goes up slowly. It just clears that tree. And that's because your forward momentum and the pitch of your quad is, is so far forward that all that thrust, the majority of it is going forwards and some is going upwards. So if you see a lot of freestyle pilots, when they're just about to pop up on something, you'll often see them sort of suddenly pitch back. And it's, it's not really a case of pitching back. It's more the fact that they're, they're just coming to level to, to jump over the tree, but they're carrying their inertia forward. So let's actually do one of these. So if we're just flying forward at a rate like this and we pump the throttle, our inertia carries, we can have a look at the tree, we can spin around, we can sort of come back again. So this video is not about like this is how you suddenly push your throttle hard, although you know if you need to use it, take it. It's more about don't do the thing where you just increase throttle and expect to go instantly up in the air. So pointing forward, lots of throttle, goes forward. And if you're more level, holding throttle goes more upwards. It's, it's pretty, pretty basic stuff really, but it's surprising how many people don't think about it when they're flying headlong into trees at great speed. And it, uh, it kind of ties in with the things I've been talking about where we're, we're doing, you know, the blip of the throttle and the manoeuvre to get around and stuff. Again, that blip of your throttle, if you're more forwards, it's going to be less pronounced than if you do a quick upwards like that. Just very quickly come to level so you can generate that little bit of lift that you want. But that's it, really. Well, that was a quick one. My battery's still alive, look. One. I say it's still alive, look, it's, it's, it's hemping in the 14s. So we'll land with that. But yeah, inertia's a good thing. Straight Uh, as per usual, questions, comments, suggestions, that sort of thing, please put them down below and I will try and answer them as best I can. Until the next time, I've got a 30 second count and I will see you next video. Bye for now. Well, you've made it to the end of the video, so thanks once again for watching. If you like what you saw, then please consider subscribing. And if you really like what you saw, then be sure to check out the link to my blog for a variety of ways in which you can help support this channel.